Hey guys, another pillow talk conversation here. Today's been quite a day for me. I've been getting attacked by a bunch of people in the trans community who, uh, in my humble opinion, I believe are very dysfunctional and have a lot of anger issues. And I find that when I go into these uh, individuals, uh, either Facebook or their YouTube channel, and they're always fighting creating ruckus with everyone and everything. Uh, we had a, a guest by the name of Kathy Brennan last week, and uh, she's a feminist, radical feminist, and um, has had some interaction, or let's say some arguments with many of the people in the trans community. And um, I believe that this person didn't start disliking trans people or having issues with trans people. I don't think she dislikes them. She's just having some friction. Uh, when she states certain beliefs, you know, she's a lesbian and radical and does not believe that uh, MTFs should be allowed in women's only spaces. You know, and uh, she's got a reason. You know, and I believe that we all should respect each other's views. So anyway, we had her on the show and we agree with a lot of the things that she says. And so now... Uh, <laughs> We're being attacked because we had her on the show and had a couple of these, like, really, really, I mean, I'm talking about really dysfunctional individuals who have been commenting on my YouTube channel. And one of these individuals by the name of Chris and goes by the, that's the real male name, who hasn't even been transitioning for more than a few months or so, according to uh, his ex wife or ex girlfriend, um, who has really given me a lot of information regarding this person. And um, you can clearly see in, in his videos and the way he writes that there's something technically very wrong. Now, they've gone ahead and they've contacted my sponsors on the shows and, you know, threatening and, and creating all sorts of lies about me. It's like, look, I'm transgender, okay? I, I've been advocating for the community since 2004. I don't agree with a lot of things the community are doing as of late, and I'm going to be verbal about it, you know. Now, this doesn't mean that I'm going to sit there and try to harm somebody's livelihood or try to, you know, do evil things to these individuals, but the way they play the game is that they want to see blood. They want to see jugglers just coming out of your veins, and, you know, it's troubling. It's troubling to see this in the community, this, this craziness, and... You know, it's gotta, we've got to stop this. We really, really have to stop this because it's gone too far. They've attacked RuPaul. They've attacked Lee, uh, Jay Leno. They've Ellen. I mean, they are attacking everybody and anything. And this should be a clear sign that something is terribly wrong with these individuals. And we can't take them too seriously. Anyway, enough about that stupidity, which I've had to deal with all day. It's been raining here terribly. I was able to go train today. It usually starts raining later in the afternoon, and it's the uh, monsoon season, so it's getting progressively worse. But you really need the rain because they've had a drought for quite a while now. I went to the gym, and I worked on my hamstrings and calves, and uh, did some stretching. I'm really enjoying the gym. I've missed it so much that it's, it's only like the part of the day that really brings me a lot of sanity, and brings me a lot of joy. I, uh, you know... If any of you out there that have been commenting and been, you know, trying to make me out to be such a bad, bad person, you, you really don't know me. You don't know what I'm all about. You don't know what I've done for this community, even before you even probably even realize that you were trans. And I've been at this for 13 years. It's been quite a while. And am I perfect? No. When I get pissed off, I will. <laughs> you will see my teeth. I don't take being bullied very kindly. I'm a loving person and I have a heart of gold. But mess with me the wrong way and you will see who I truly am. I don't take BS from anybody. And if I have to give you the shirt off my back, I will. But you try to twist things around, you try to I just I don't even have the words right now because I've had to deal with these cycles all day long, you know, and it's not right. It's not right at all. 
anyways, what else to say? I'm just, right now, uh, between the breakup, you know, Jessica's still here, and until, you know, she finally leaves, I mean, it's kind of hard, it's almost like continuing to poke a wound that doesn't heal, you know, and, you know, it's having to, to deal with situations that are, they're not very, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? They're not good. So, anyway... Just wanted to make a quick video, and um, I do want to make videos in more of a positive note, out in nature, more spiritual. But right now, I'm not in the headspace for that because it's it, it's a troubling time right now in my life. But this too shall pass, and everything will be good. And as always, and um, you know, it's life. We learn from it. We learn from these lessons. We learn from the events, the challenges, the people around us, the the challenges that are that are put there sometimes to teach us things and to be human is to err. So, anyway guys, I love you. And remember to always 